Okay, so I just found out about this about 10 minutes ago. <laughs> Race to the Rock 2017. I knew of Race to the Rock last year as Rock. This this <laughs> this makes Indie Pack look like a I won't say a picnic, I would say it looks makes Indie Pack look like your grade three recess. Easy as this is uh you gotta read this. I'll, I'll link it to our Facebook page now below. You can have a read. Um the statistics don't lie, you probably don't want to enter, and you're probably not capable of completing the race of the rock. And uh, you don't know it yet. I hate for you to find out when you're on this trail from hundreds of kilometers from safety. It's safer, less painful, less soul destroying to remain a dot watcher. This it makes indie pack look I mean you <laughs> look at this. Someone's got a like this is insane, mate. You know? This I mean Indie Park was is epic. And it's is great that Jesse and the gang have organized another bike packing event. It's uh it's the right thing to do to celebrate life. And uh, Indie Park was a gateway for a lot of people and it sparked the fire re sparked the fire in me for epic cycling, even though it only lasted like a day. But it just teaches you so much about life, you know, the clock's always ticking and He'd be gone at any minute. He'd be gone at any minute. So enjoy the moment, man. Enjoy the moment. Um, fuck, mate. This is epic shit. So it's it seems to be mostly off-road. So it looks like a mountain bike race, I would say. Correct me if I'm wrong. It looks like a mountain bike race. I would say riding a road bike on this much gravel would be uh, would be interesting. And corrugations and mud. So I'd, I'd definitely say mountain bike race mountain bikes only and it goes middle of Australia I mean who's ever ridden I've never ridden out here I've ridden across Australia before I know what's involved I've never ridden this much dirt 3,000 k's of gravel I mean I've never done that before I've ridden from I'll show you where I've ridden I've ridden from Perth to Adelaide down to Melbourne um, I've ridden from Adelaide across the Byron Bay up through Gold Coast, Brisbane, all the way up, and I've ridden to the very, very tip of Cape York up there in Bamaga, Seizure Resort, up the top there, very, very top, northernmost part of Australia, but I've never ridden through here, so I wouldn't have a freaking clue of how hard this would be, but I would say it'd be fucking tough, just even if you're just touring it, it would be fucking insane, but in a race format, this is going to crack so many people, because there's no hotels, there's no hotels I mean, sorry, there is a few hotels here and there, but, like, you know, fuck all. So you're going to be camping, and camping would crack a lot of people. There would be minimal gas stations. You know, unlike with Indy Park, you get a lot of gas stations. Across Nullarbor, then you, you're good to go. But this just looks, like, insane. Will I do it? Um, I'll be overseas at that time. If I wanted to do it, though, I'd have to change my plans, wouldn't I? Who knows? I'm not going to commit to it yet. Um, it, 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 the, the temptation is incredible though, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I mean, the temptation is there because I've never ever ridden, I don't know if I could ride that far on gravel. You know, I know I could ride across Australia, but this, this looks like a different level. This looks definitely harder than any pack. It's a lot shorter, but you're going to be going a lot slower, so the overall time will probably be similar. The isolation will be more because there'll be no cars and people cheering you on and, you know, it would be a lot less entrance. It looks fucking insane. This this would be the hardest bike race in 2017. 2017 for sure. We just had Indy pack. Now this. This is good.